First of all, you ain't got one of these. You need to snatch yourself up one. All right. Everybody going crazy in the in the NBA world. Isaiah Thomas just got traded to the Lakers, right? And I don't think too many people have seen this coming. I ain't going to lie. I thought Isaiah was just going to stick it out with the Cavs rest of the season and just continue to be just a, a nuisance among the team. Because <laughs> Isaiah, he's been talking a lot of crap since he got back. Um, and he only been back for, what, 15 games, 16 games? And he's, he's out of here. Right, and it's funny because I was watching the game last night when LeBron hit that game winner. If you if you pay close attention, you see when LeBron hit that game winner, and he ran back to the bench and he did chest bumps and he was jumping up in the air. He kind of didn't even pay Isaiah no damn attention. Isaiah was looking like trying to reach him and touch him, like congrats, congrats, LeBron. LeBron was looking like I don't even see you, dog. I don't even see you, dog. And that 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 should have been a little a clue. But check this out. Not only did they get rid of Isaiah Thomas, they traded Jay Crowder, which they just got with Isaiah, and they got rid of Derrick Rose, which Derrick Rose shouldn't be a surprise because let's be real. Derrick Rose, they hurt as hell all the time. So, I mean, it kind of makes sense. But So it looks like I think Jay Crowder and um, Derrick Rose went to Utah, so you'll probably never hear from them again. <laughs> like, if you, if you want to see them play, you should have been watching the Cavs if you ever want to see them on TV. Other than that, I think you got to live in Utah to check them out. But uh, so the question is now, uh, and now who the Cavs get? They got Larry Nance Jr. They got George Hill. George Hill could ball. I forget where he came from, but George Hill could ball. I don't know if he was with the Jazz or not, but George Hill straight. Uh, they got Larry Jans, La what the fuck? Larry Nance Jr. and somebody else. I forget who they got for uh, Isaiah from the Lakers, whatever. But so, I mean, literally the Cavs basically just scrapped their whole team and got a whole new squad now. So, it should be it should be interesting. So, now the pressure is still on the Cavs, to be honest with you, because now if they don't win the East and don't win a championship, they still going to look back and be like, see, y'all did all that for nothing. For nothing. Y'all might as well kept Isaiah, right? But I'm curious to see if this makes the Cavs a better team. Um... Honestly, you know, I'm not a Cavs fan, but honestly, I do think this is going to make the team a little better. I mean, they still got D-Wade. they still waiting on Love to get back. So I'm thinking the Cavs going to – I think they're going to win the East. But, you know, when they get to that finals, the Warriors, they're going to tap that ass. What do you think? Let's go. Maybe it's just the way I play. Maybe it's in my DNA. Maybe it's the reason I have arrived and I am here to stay. 